It always ranks among top concerns for San Antonians, homelessness. The city seems to be making progress on that. San Antonio is one of the first cities around the country to find long-term housing for 1,500 people previously out on the streets. Camelia Juarez with the story of how a man went from homeless to housed. Alan Green was a business owner selling glass art, but when his health declined, so did his finances. So when I was in the hospital for over 100 days, um, I was evicted from my apartment. I lost everything. After spending 16 nights sleeping on park benches, Green came to Haven for hope. He spent four months here and was accepted into the rapid rehousing program. It pays for a year's worth of rent and utilities. I just started putting that money in the bank. Because when I walked into Haven, all I had were pennies in my pocket. Billy Mahone from South Alamo Regional Alliance for the Homeless says rapid rehousing is a temporary wraparound assistance to help people become sustainable. Mahone says rent rising by 14% from last year is one of many reasons why these programs are in growing need. A lot more people have been ex experiencing housing insecurity than in years past uh, due to rising rent prices, property taxes, just inflation costs in general, and even, you know, the wage growth not keeping up pace with those costs. Uh, so it's put a strain on the, the uh, upstream and then downstream. Mahone says based on the point in time counts, there has not been a spike in homelessness over the last couple years. He says it's because of the surge of federal aid funding, which Green benefited from. Green says he looks forward to seeing Social Security checks increase by 8% in January. And when you've been through what I've been through, to say you're fine, I'm blessed. Green continues to see his rent reduced through a voucher from Opportunity Home. Gamalia Juarez, KSAT 12 News.